Well, a man says his final goodbye to his best friend and fellow officer in Emmett. The Emmett police chief and his dog Roscoe were rear-ended by a semi-truck earlier this month. The dog sadly didn't make it. Sierra Oshron explains how the community came together to honor the fallen officer. Roscoe was known and loved by many in Emmett. Yesterday they celebrated his life and service to his community. Just a great dog and he loved people, loved kids. Everybody in town knows him. Chief Shine and his dog Roscoe have been fighting crime together for the last 12 years. Mitchell was taken the first of the year and you can see he's starting to get gray and everything and then this is his ashes. Roscoe still had a few years left in him but his life was cut short when a semi slammed into their car at this intersection. And I was sitting at the stoplight at John's in the highway. He hit us from behind doing about 45 or 50. Chief Shine was taken to St. Al's, but not before his best friend was transported to the Gem Veterinary Clinic. We all got together quickly. We started putting IV fluids straight into him. We immediately started doing x-rays. That's when they found severe damage to his spine. From the hospital, Shine's wife called the shelter for an update. How's my boy doing? How's my boy crying? And I'm like, well, how's Gary doing? And she's like, oh, you know, the old man will be fine. But I worry about Roscoe. Medical crews, officers, and council members came to pay their respects before Roscoe was put down. My favorite part was Rosemary saying, this is the way the old man would want to go with pomp and circumstances. There would be no laying on a down by a tree and going peacefully. He had to make sure that the world knew here he was. His memorial service was just as grand. Police from all over the state came to wish their fellow officer goodbye. He would have liked it. He was a live and let live dog and every day was fun for him. Roscoe was one of four dogs in the canine unit, all of which have been rescued. Chief Shine tells me they don't have a new dog picked out yet, but he's confident that one who needs saving will come into his life at the right time. In the newsroom, Sierra Oshrin, KBOI 2 News.